welcome back to my channel this is cuisine demand the only channel where we excite your taste bud today i'm going to teach you another way you can cook your chicken if you are tired of frying grilling whatever it is you used to do to your chicken and you are tired of it and this is the video for you okay i'm not going to talk too much let's get right into it but before i do that if today's the first time visiting my channel please and please subscribe like share any of our videos from this channel and if you have already been watching and you are not a subscriber yet please do so okay so first and foremost i am going to prep my chicken i have already washed my chicken nicely with lemon juice and at this moment i'm putting all my dry um seasonings together i'm going to use chester dry ones today so i'm putting all of them together and um, i'll also be leaving the list of the seasonings in my description box below so that you can check it out anytime you want to try it okay so i'm going to put everything together mix it very well make sure everything is well combined and then i um sprinkle them on onto my chicken and make sure that every part of this chicken is covered with this seasoning that is very important okay so we are going to make sure that we um, massage the seasonings onto our chicken very very carefully we should be intentional about it okay And just after massaging the seasonings onto the other part, I'm going to turn it over and do the same thing to the other side of the chicken so we can have an even taste when our chicken is ready, okay? Just after massaging the seasonings into my chicken and making sure everything is well coated with the seasoning, I'm going to cover it with my foil and allow it to marinate for about 30 to 40 minutes. So this is after the chicken has marinated, I'm going to go ahead and pour um, some oil into my hot pan and fry the chicken for some time. This is me um, trying to brown our chicken a little bit. Um, this is not going to cook the chicken okay this is just going to give it a little flavor and also make sure it is golden brown about 15 minutes um frying this chicken i'm going to turn it over for the other side to also brown a little bit okay So at this point, both sides of the chicken are well browned just the way I want it, okay? So as you can see, I am going to take it out of the oil and then we'll continue with the sauce. This is the sauce that brings the magic to the chicken. This is the sauce that adds the flavor to the chicken. And um, in the same oil, I am going to start with my sauce. So I'm going to add in my minced garlic and also my um, diced onions. I'm going to fry them till I can perceive the aroma. And just when you realize that onions are translucent, you go ahead and add in your whipping cream. You mix it carefully and make sure everything is well combined and then you add in some seasonings. I added in some leftover um, seasonings, sorry, some leftover seasonings from the chicken and also some green seasonings and my chicken um, seasonings as well. I also went in with a little bit of salt 
just to prevent the sauce from tasting um, bland okay we are going to add it to the chicken anyways but we don't want it to taste bland all right we, it has to be well seasoned After adding all the seasonings, I'm going to go ahead and stir it till everything is well mixed and allow it to come to a boil. Right, just when it does, I'm going to add in my rainbow bell peppers. Okay, I have my red, my orange, my green, and also my um, yellow bell pepper. I'm going to add it to it, and you know, these things are very healthy, so I'm not going to. Um, boil it for a very long time because uh, they would go into the oven as well and just after adding my bell pepper i already said it i am not going to cook it for a very long time because we still need our vegetables to be fresh so i'm going to allow it to boil for about 15 seconds and then that will be it so this is where i am arranging my chicken into my baking um pan i'm going to add in the sauce that we just prepared i'm going to make sure every part of it is well covered with the sauce okay that is very necessary it is very necessary because um, you need the flavor from the sauce into the chicken so we make sure that every part of it is well covered with the sauce okay And just as I mentioned earlier, every part of this chicken needs to absorb this sauce. It is very important, okay? So I'm going to give the chicken a little lift so that the sauce can enter under the, I mean, it can go under the chicken very, very, very well. That one is very important. So just after making sure all part of the chicken is well absorbed in the sauce, I'm going to cover it with my foil and put it into my oven. And this is going to bake for about 30 minutes and... Ladies and gentlemen, our chicken is ready. That is it. It is ready. And guys, as you can see, our chicken is... It, it looks good. It looks so sumptuous. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to this channel. Like, comment, share any of our videos. Try any of our recipes and let me know. And always remember, in a world where you can be anything, be kind. Bye.